So, uh, Diamond, uh, now, like you said, you know, you've won two great cups in a row. You'd like to win three. Um, what other career objectives have you set for yourself? And obviously, you look like you can still play for a few more years. You know, on the football side of it, you know, I basically just want to play, you know, as long as I can and just to be a winner, you know. And, and right now, I'm on a winning team. I'm on, I'm on a team where guys do the right things when they're supposed to, and they usually end up with a W. But, you know, for my career, after, do you, you want to know about my, what I'm planning for after football? Or just yeah, football? yeah, I'm curious about that as well because I know some SU guys have done and I know, by the way, you've got a special glove that you and your agent are, are starting to market. Uh, and maybe you can, you know, uh, I'm sure that's part of your future as well. Yeah, yeah. You know, we've been working on this glove for the last three years. Um, it's basically a football glove that was made by me and one of my other teammates, Eric Delorier, with some influence from, you know, my agent Fred, Fred Weinrush and Steve Stein. You know, it's basically a glove that is made for players, by players. The glove has been tested throughout the CFL for the last three years. We've had about, we're on the seventh generation of gloves. You know, with this glove, the best thing about it is, like, we got to pick. We're instrumental in choosing all the fabrics that went into the glove. You know, the the, the fabrics that we used were tested by rugby players in Europe. Um, the neoprene that we used for the knuckles, it, it's awesome because it lets your knuckles breathe and it looks stylish. And, you know, we're actually uh, we're on some next-level stuff. And, like, the stick for our glove that we're using right now, the new stick, it could be in head of, like, Glove companies like Under Armour, Reebok, and Cutters, but that's just, you know, we'll never know until the product is fully, fully out there and in the market and we're selling, selling, selling. Because right now, you know, we got a couple contracts with some real football teams, some CIS colleges, and, you know, we got players across the CFL wearing the gloves. So, you know, hopefully that could work out. And, you know, after my football, I'll still be involved in football. Good. And then uh, awesome. good. approximately, Diamond, how many guys in the CFL you got wearing your glove? Uh, you know, probably about 15 guys on different teams at least two guys on every team because wow. you know for the for, for the first two years we were giving gloves out to guys guys in bc guys in toronto uh we actually sponsored two guys for the alouettes um chip cox and uh atm boule mm-hmm. so you know it's a good quality glove i've been wearing it for the last three years and uh you know they make they make big plays happen like Chip, Chip Cox, he just scored a 108-yard touchdown wearing these gloves. You know, I'm so happy. I'm proud that he's wearing our glove, and I'm proud that, you know, the, the gloves work. Yeah, well, now you got to get everybody at Syracuse wearing them, too. <laughs> you know, and, and they're all black. They're slick. It's a sexy glove. <laughs> you're, quite, you're quite the salesperson there, Diamond. You don't have to sell yeah, me, I mean, buddy. You're from Syracuse, I believe you. You know, you, you, got, you got the cred right there. So, uh <laughs> Listen, I'm going to look forward to meeting you when you guys visit Toronto. We'll have a nice chat, and I'll show you all my Syracuse uh, memorabilia. I got a ton of it. So uh, yeah, I, can't, I can't wait to come down and meet you. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, it sure will. Listen, thanks for taking so much time, and uh, we'll definitely chat again. And best of luck. Hopefully you hoist another great cup, and uh, I'll look forward to seeing you in Toronto. Thanks for doing this, Diamond. Great to have you on Norm at night. Thanks, Norm. You bet.